Hello everyone, it's Glenn from Backlands Fish. The following video will be showcasing my breeding group of red ribbon peacocks. And we'll have a bit of a chat about the whole uh, line breeding aspect to these beautiful fish. I hope you enjoy it. So what we're looking at here is my young group of Red Reuben Peacocks, which is the common trade name for these guys here in Australia. They sometimes get called a Red Ruby or a Ruby Red, um, but typically go under the umbrella of a German uh, line bred style of Red Peacock. One of the uh, issues with the hobby of cichlid keeping is the, the constant changing of names and it's always good to be working on the same information. I've found this is a tremendous resource whenever I'm dealing with name issues, the cichlidforum.com. It's got a lot of uh, great info and in particular I, I am always referring to the species profile section to get some very basic information various cichlids and I find that this does update frequently. Once you click into the species profile page, head on down you'll see the genus drop down and if you open it up and start typing, unfortunately it's not very clever, it, it keeps changing to whatever the last key you hit, but go down and find your Alonacara and here we are, we've got uh, a hell of a lot of peacocks listed here. The, the Red Reuben or Ruby Reds appear up the top common name there. We're going to have a quick look at the profile that's provided. Now what you'll see here is a very basic set of information but this does give you the option of a uh, bit, of, bit of a description and some different picks. We also have the option of some articles which relate to the subject of peacocks. Um, this includes general, general articles and sometimes more specific information. In this case, we have a little article about the whole subject of the German line bread style of peacocks. And in essence, what we're dealing with here is that the red Reuben peacock is a legitimate species of, of cichlid that has been um, selectively line bred where a, a desirable colour morph from the lake has been um, bred over and back upon itself to to enhance that beautiful red colour that we see here. Um, I believe this particular fish originally was Alonacara Stuart Grant I Chipoka, which apparently in the wild it's, will exist in a, a number of colour morphs ranging from sort of almost yellow through to the, the strong red. And obviously this is a favourable colour for the aquarium. Anyway, back to my particular group of fish here. These um, these peacocks are actually bred in Thailand, and I access these through one of my wholesalers. Um, the, the quality is really very high, I believe, uh, especially in this this sort of line bred stuff. That, that, um, it's just done with great attention to detail in that part of the world. That my my purpose with having this group of fish is to to breed these to be able to sell on as part of my wholesale list to aquarium stores and obviously most aquarium stores are probably favoring 
colourful fish over particularly rare and unusual fish which is a bit more specialised. Um, I do have other groups of peacocks that, that um, have legitimate lines of fish based on location in the lake and I'll, I'll make more videos as I uh, find time. But it, yeah, once again, this, this colony of fish is, is to be bred or resale to to uh, aquarium stores and hopefully we can work on getting the ratio where there's a lot more males than females because it looks like out of the 12 or so fish that I've got here it's incredibly heavy on females which is wonderful for breeding but unfortunately those those females aren't going to be great sellers at the pet store unless we do some some colour feeding and a bit of um, stuff which I really don't favour because it's a bit unethical to to portray fish as something they're not. Anyway, I hope you've enjoyed meeting my red ribbon peacocks and we'll see you in another video. Thanks for watching.